CPU cache is a hardware to reduce the latency of accessing data from the main memory. It's very important in modern computers and has dramatic impact on CPU execution time. CPU cache is much smaller than memory and is much faster than memory. If CPU needs to fetch some data and finds out the data has been cached, from the CPU's perspective, it no longer needs to wait for the memory and gets its job done almost immediately. Therefore, after accessing a block from the memory, it places the block in certain parts of the cache. A set is a group of blocks which divides the cache. If a block can be placed in a restricted set of places in the cache, the cache is set associated. For example, a iron data cache in Intel i7-7700K has a size of 32 kilobytes. The size of each cache block, aka cache line, is 64 bytes, and it's 8-way set associated. So it has 512 blocks and 64 cache sets. For any memory blocks, it can be placed in 8 possible cache lines in a certain cache set. To locate the data in the cache, we split memory address into three parts, tag, set index, and offset within the block. We need 6 bits for the set index and 6 bits for the offset. Since the address has 64 bits, there are 52 bits left for the tag. If the tag is in a set and is marked as valid, then we can safely use it without waiting for memory. When the tag is not in the set or is marked as invalid, we have a cache miss. In this case, cache controller must select a block to be replaced with the desired data. Hopefully, it gives you a better understanding of how cache works. Thank you for watching.